guys what's going on so today i am doing a video that i collabed with janelle aka black is beautiful healthy janelle and janelle b stewart she has three different channels make sure you check her out at the end of this video i'm doing a giveaway she is also doing a video and is doing a giveaway on her channel so make sure you check out her channel i'll leave that in the description box below you have two chances to enter one on her channel and one on mine today's video is going to be three things that i would never ever 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 feed my child that i grew up eating so let's get into it the first one on my list is ramen noodles. I grew up calling them ramen noodles. Most people call them ramen noodles, ramen noodles, whatever floats your boat, wherever you're from. I'm from an area where we call them ramen noodles. I would never feed him ramen noodles. Reason being, well, I'm not going to say never, ever feed him, but I would never feed him ramen noodles like how I ate them. Now... Growing up, I grew up in a single family home. My mom was the provider. My dad didn't really do anything. I think I saw him maybe five times out of my whole life. <clears throat> um, with that being said, you know, I was always at daycare or I was with my babysitter after daycare until my mom would get off. My mom worked at the hospital and she worked 12 hour shifts. So anybody that's in nursing or actually in the medical field, then you know how hectic the schedules can be and having a child and being a single parent is hard as hell. But my mom made it work. Now, my babysitter, she didn't care what I ate. Like I would eat hamburgers, I would eat hot dogs, I ate ramen noodles, I ate potato chips. I had juice boxes like I had all the bad stuff that you supposed to have that's what I had like the only time I remember my mom really cooking is whenever I asked her to make me spaghetti because spaghetti was always my favorite dish or like during the holidays for like 4th of July Christmas Thanksgiving those types of things where you did the traditional foods but that's really the only time my mom had off so she could cook so I had to get it how I could. She would always take me to McDonald's and get me McDonald's like french fries and chicken nuggets and stuff like that. But I always remember eating ramen noodles. Like I would eat ramen noodles breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks in between right before bedtime. Like most people would have cereal seven times a day. I was eating ramen noodles seven times a day. That was me. But I would... I would not say I would never feed him that. I would give it to him, but it wouldn't be like as much as I ate it. I would probably give it to him maybe once or twice a week, if that. So the second thing that I would not give him is the Kool-Aid. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I, I don't know. Like, I like Kool-Aid, but I mean, and I'm not going to throw the race card out there, but y'all know how people that people of color get when it comes to Kool-Aid and they get when it comes to grits and oatmeal and stuff like that you put sugar and I ain't talking about like no half a cup I'm talking about like freaking six or seven cups of sugar you got about this much of sugar at the bottom of your like tub full of freaking Kool-Aid and you got maybe this much Kool-Aid like this much sugar this much Kool-Aid and then the rest of it is full of water like I don't know I grew up that way I'm not doubting it I'm not saying it's bad you know I came out fine but my son ain't drinking it I he can have tea he can have sweet tea but he ain't getting no no extra sugar put in there that's that's just how it's gonna be all that extra sugar no 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 we we're not starting that we are not starting that where you putting sugar on your grits sugar on your oatmeal sugar in your freaking sweet tea sugar in your kool-aid no we're not doing that we're not going there no we're not you are not fixing to mess around and be diabetic like a lot of my family members are i'm not saying it's right and i'm not saying it's wrong but for me and mine we're not doing all this sugar so the kool-aid you can forget it my third one is going to be hot dogs. I ate a lot of hot dogs. 
but I ate my hot dogs raw. I grew up eating hot dogs all the time, but I would eat like the sausage dogs, I would eat the hot dogs, the beef dogs, the turkey dogs, anything that was in hot dog form, I would eat it. Um, a lot of times I would eat them raw, and I know y'all probably like, ooh, disgusting, but to a kid, you're not going to sit here and think, oh, I want it cooked all the way through. Now, I was picky with my hot dogs. I didn't too much care for them being medium done. I wanted mine to be done to the point where they were busting open. And then when they bust open, I would turn around, chop them in half, put them on some bread, slather them in ketchup, put some cheese on it, and I would eat it just like that. My son, he eats bread by itself. He'll eat hot dogs by itself. He won't eat cheese by itself. He's a very picky eater. He's a lot pickier than I was. Um, I think he'd get that from his daddy. But I would never feed him as many hot dogs as I ate. Like, I ate hot dogs like french fries. I'm not feeding him hot dogs like that. Like, if he gets a hot dog, it's probably going to be maybe two or three of them a week, if that. We trying to be on this healthy kick and trying to eat more fruits and vegetables and stuff like that. We No, we're not doing hot dogs. We just, we're not. That concludes my video. I hope you guys loved it. Make sure you check out Janelle's channel. I'll leave that in the description box below. So, what you're going to be winning is a $25 gift card to Target. And I'm pretty sure that you guys shop at Target. If you're not shopping at Target, you better get on it because Target is where it's at. And $25 can go a long way for anybody that shops at Target, especially those that coupon. So, we are both offering the exact same thing, which is a $25 gift card at Target. First, you have to be a subscriber to my channel. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button at the top. Make sure you thumbs up this video if you have not done that already. Leave a comment down below saying, enter me. And if you want to enter Janelle's giveaway as well to try to win her gift card, make sure you head over to her channel. Her rules are the exact same. Make sure you are subscribed to her channel, you thumbs up the video, and you also put enter me down at the bottom and put that I sent you. I will leave it at that. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. For all you motherfuckers that speak English though, that don't know what I just said, uh, very much don't worry, we're not trying to rebel or anything like that, but you know, just um, keep doing what you're doing, you know, you're looking good, you might want to put some pants on. <laughs>